Begin by sterilizing some salt water. You can do this with heat or in larger volumes with bleach and neutralizing it. Once cooled or neutralized, it's ready to use. I aim for a salinity of about 30 ppt. You'll need water pitchers, 70% isopropyl alcohol, a bag or container, F2 fertilizer, silicate for diatoms, uh, tubing, cotton balls, and a pipette or syringe. If using RO tubing, make sure to clean inside and outside and remove any ink with alcohol. Clean any rigid tubing with a pipe cleaner. I use soap and water and then rinse with alcohol. Next, make sure to sterilize your workspace with the alcohol. My Fido is grown in wide mouth glass jars. Clean the lid with a clean paper towel and sanitize with the alcohol. Sanitize one pitcher with alcohol. Once it's dried, pour your culture into the pitcher. I use bags to keep things more sterile and for easy cleanup. Some settling is normal, discard the bag, or if you don't use bags, make sure to clean the jars real well. Replace with a new clean bag, pour some salt water in it, and pull tight to make sure that all creases are gone. Using a fresh pipette or syringe, dose the fertilizer. I'm using for its two-part fertilizer doing two milliliters of part A and part B. This is using a sterile syringe. For diatoms, I like to use a different F2 fertilizer. This one is a single part. Add two mils of that, and then two milliliters of silicate. Add some phyto back in. I like to do about a 40% phyto ratio, meaning about 1250 milliliters of phyto and 1750 milliliters of salt water. Make sure all alcohol is dried and replace the RO tubing and lid. The leftover is your harvest. Pour these in sanitized bottles or mix them together. I like to keep some separate as a backup in case I need to restart a culture if it crashes. I also have some parvo pods. These require live ISO. I pour the leftovers in a gallon bag and I'm going to mix this with all my other Fido and store it in the fridge. Clean the pitcher with soap and hot water, wipe it dry with a clean paper towel, and then sanitize with alcohol, and it's ready to go again. Now that I've harvested and mixed all of my phytoplankton, I'm going to store this in the refrigerator. Thanks for watching and happy reefing.